and they light up. And these were on clearance for $7. So she'll have a cute pair of shoes for the summer. Okay, so this was one, the. You didn't give me a tackle box. He did, a Spider-Man one. Morning. So I'm up early this morning before most of the household. Skylar and Matt are up and they're out fishing this morning so I'm hoping they have some good luck. I know they've been wanting to get out and get that early morning catch so we'll see when they get home how they do. Right now I'm about to get ready for the day. Matt and I have some shopping to do. I think T might be going with us and Aspen as well so I'm trying to be quiet because not everybody's up yet. And look at this little one crashed on the living room floor last night because we do not have air conditioning up in her room and it has been so hot. Zane crashed out on his daddy's recliner. Even Braxton got invented to beat the heat. He crashed out on two chairs in the dining room. Look at though, he has quite the setup going. He pulled two of our comfy chairs together and made it into a bed. Turn it up, daddy. Why? Your very first fishing fish pole? Too. You don't need that, I promise. I need some of this. What is this? <laughs> That's bait. You don't need that bait, though. You'll use worms. Mm, what are you eating, Aspen? Quit and sour sauce. Sweet and sour sauce? What'd you get? I got some broccoli chicken, little noodles, and some rice. Braxton, were you just eating mm -hmm. garlic bread and sweet and sour? A different combination. What'd you get? You got lots of fruit and stuff, huh? Is that fish on your plate? Ooh, yummy. I don't think I'd eat the skin. How's the skin? You like it? So we're back from shopping and I thought I'd share a few of the things with you that we picked up. I like to share with you guys when I get really, really good deals. And so I wasn't planning on doing any summer clothes shopping or any fall shopping and I ended up picking up one fall item for Ireland today. But I thought I'd share with you some of the really cool deals and some of the things that we pick up on a regular basis for our large family and how we save money. So this is Ireland's part of the haul. So everything that I got here was from Walmart and these were super cute and really, really good deals. So she fell in love with these super sparkly tennis shoes. And then, if I can get them to work, there. And they light up. And these were on clearance for $7. So she'll have a cute pair of shoes for the summer. And the rest of this is all summer clothes that I picked up for her. Now these are all her current size that she's in. So I've been a really big fan of these, um, Wonder Nation and I think they're I think for the little girls. It's all Wonder Nation is the brand. Yeah Wonder Nation is the brand um, Through Walmart and these range anywhere from like 482 to 282 So a couple of these pieces were 282 and then the rest were 382 so I just got her this plain black v-neck shirt but That will go with I love these they'll look so cute with those tennis shoes these little shorts and they've got like sparkly butterflies on them. They're just stretchy, super cute, fun shorts for the summer. So I thought that would be a really cute outfit on her. Okay, so the next outfit that I picked up for her, and I love these, is another pair of those shorts. These ones were two, okay, so it's 297 is the range to like 482 or something like that, or 487. But these ones were the 297 and so it's just a really cute little pattern on these and then to go with them I picked up this t-shirt this one was 382 and it's just a little plain pink v-neck t-shirt that I thought would be really cute together and then she has other pieces that these can mix and match with so it'll look like different outfits I picked her up another pair of the capri leggings and these ones were also 382 and I love those stripes on them I think they're really cute and then I just picked her up the plain like magenta or fuchsia, I guess this color would be. Fuchsia to go with it, or she can wear it with those shorts so it'll look like different outfits. 
Now this item I picked up, I'm not sure it's gonna fit her this year because this is a 14, 16, and right now she's in a 10, 12 size. She can still wear some 7, 8s depending on the brand, but for the most part she's in a 10, 12. But this was $3. And she really loves all that Disney stuff, so I figured even if it doesn't fit her this year, she'll still be into this stuff because she's little enough. She'll still be into this stuff next year, and I just thought that was so cute. It'll be really easy to pick her up a plain pair of shorts to go with it or a little skirt, something like that, and then it's just plain white. It's super soft, so I thought that was really cute. And then one last thing that I picked up for her, this is actually for the fall, and this is also a 10-12. This was a dollar, you guys. So this is just the Faded Glory. It's a plain V-neck, like, long sleeve t-shirt, plain white shirt. But I just thought for a dollar, I couldn't pass it up. This will give her an extra piece of clothing for the fall and winter coming up. So that's one of the things that I do with our large family to try to save money and to still be able to dress the kids in some newer clothes, especially like in the winter, in the summertime when they're so hard on their clothes. There's no point in spending a lot on pieces that they're going to wear every day. So I'll pick up a lot of those cheaper clearance priced items and then I'll buy a size bigger. If it's not something that's like, a video game or something like that unless it's something that's really popular and you know is a little bit more timeless it's gonna have a longer lifestyle I'll pick up stuff like that like the Beauty and the Beast or like a plain t-shirt that's a size or two bigger if I can find it for a dollar because I know that they'll end up wearing it so that's one of the ways that I save money is to buy sizes up or if I know they're gonna be in that size later on in the season because they're just entering the size and I can pick it up for 50 cents, a dollar. I found brand new pieces of clothing for 10 cents before on the rack because it was the end of the season and I just bought a size bigger. Um, I did that for Aspen and I had it for I think two or three years I had this shirt put away and it was a super cute, just really classic style button up shirt and he had brand new clothes put away for him when he got into that size. So that's one of the ways that we save money in our large family is to buy out of season because with kids clothes, they don't really go out of style too much unless it's like a particular cartoon character or something like that that might be just a fad. That stuff can go out of style, but for the most part, their cuts and stuff like that of clothing is pretty similar, and it doesn't go out of style very quickly. In a couple of years, that clothing will be fine. All right, so this part of the haul is for Zane. Now, everything that I got in this part of the haul for him is $3. Everything was on clearance for $3, so I was pretty excited about it. So these next two shirts will fit him this summer. So we got him this one. It's a Justice League shirt, and it's got like all the characters in a darker gray. It's got like Superman and everybody on it. So I thought he would get a kick out of that because he really loves this Justice League stuff. Okay, so this was one, the This was another one of the $3 shirts. This was a Lego Batman shirt. I love how it has all the characters on there. And Zane is really into Lego Batman, so he's gonna love it. He hasn't even seen it yet. So these two are for next summer, but they were on sale for $3 as well. And it's a Mario shirt. I make awesome happen. So I thought, and Mario, I mean, that's been around forever. It's not something that's gonna go out of style. So I don't mind buying it a size bigger and I know Zane will still be into it. He loves Mario, especially Luigi's Mansion. And then I got him this one. And this one also will fit him next summer. So it's just a regular Pokemon shirt, gotta catch them all. I like that it has this sparkle on the front of it though. I thought that was really neat. Okay, so this last part is for Aspen. One item was a sale item and one we did buy at full price. So this shirt was the sale item, the Justice League, and I love the detail on it. It looks like, the way the shirt's made looks like stars in the background and it's got the Justice League symbol on the front. So this was only $3 and then these were full price. We paid $12.87 for these, but that still wasn't bad. It's a pair of Paw Patrol sandals and it's got the nice hard soles. So he's really, he loves his sandals and he has been in desperate need of a new pair. He had outgrown his, but insisted he had to wear his Spider-Man sandals for the first part of the spring. So now he has a new pair. So this was something new I decided to try and pick up for the house. So Matt and I actually picked up two sets of these. We got the Glade Warmers, which we've had these before, but they have a new limited edition scent called floral enchant or enchanted floral garden this smells so amazing and this came in the three packs so we picked up six of these well two packs 
but six of these and then four of the warmers. So I'm really excited to plug these in in the kitchen Mom, and living room. Mom, yeah? I want to wear my shoes. You want to wear your new shoes? You have to go wash off the bottom of your feet because they were a little dirty I from running around. I can still wear them. I hope you enjoyed shopping with us today. Oh, I love your sandals. They're so cute. They look really nice on you. Do they feel good? I can wear these on the cup. You can today because you haven't worn them outside yet. I really like your shoes. Okay, so I have been trying to tell you guys for about the last 10 minutes. If you like the video, give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to click the subscribe button if you haven't already. But this is what happens behind the scenes when you're trying to film a haul with a four year old. Check out my. How's your heat rash today? Oh, it's going away. That's good. Yay. Where are you going? Fishing now. Going with your new fishing pole and your tackle box that daddy got you? What is that face <laughs> for? Oh, he didn't give me a tackle box. He did? A Spider-Man one. Oh. Uh, uh. <laughs> anyway, guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs>